Hello everyone, welcome to this video and welcome to my channel, I'm Ryan and today we are here with another tutorial in Photoshop. Today we want to learn the best two methods of underlining a text. So you know, for making a text bold or make it important, you'll need underlining a text, so it's very common to use it in Photoshop. So let's go for the first and common way. Let me create a text from here. For example, I'm just writing forest here. Let me make it bigger. At first, I'm selecting the move tool using V on my keyboard, then Ctrl T to see the transform. And let's make it bigger to see what we are gonna do. So, uh, yeah, I believe it's enough. Now, under the character panel that you can find it under window and character, you can see lots of options up here that you can change all of them. So, here the only we need is the underline. So, I'm just selecting the text double click on it and now you can select this one with the name of underline so click on it and you can see that there is underline appeared it's very easy and it was very common to use this underline so let's go to the second method of underlining so I'm just turning off this underline here just by selecting the text and clicking on the underline again here we have the text without our underline so the next way to underline a text is using a line and you can create a custom underline for your text. So just hold your click under this shape and you can select a line tool and now you can start drawing your line here. If you want to draw a horizontal and vertical line, you can just hold your shift button on keyboard and start drawing your line. So here is my line and I can start changing the stroke at the color and other options here we have. For example here, I don't need any feel for this and I need a little stroke with the green color so let me just increase the stroke okay as well and now here is our result you know both of the ways are easy and handy but the first one is easier the second one you can create custom underline you can create whatever you like in every places in every color and so the second one is kind of more creative and the first one is very simple. So this video is also over. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video. And if you have any questions, just tell me in the comment section below. I'll be glad to answer. Thank you for watching and don't forget to see other videos in this channel. See you in the next video.